Eyewitness News reporter Sia New Yorker has the latest from Emporia. Many of the strikers we spoke with here say they're already living paycheck to paycheck. And with news of the Dolly Madison Bakery closing, they say there won't be much money to spend around town. You figure three, four, five hundred people out of a job aren't going to be spending the money like they used to. I know I'm going to cut down on everything. Jeff Horton worked at the Dolly Madison Bakery for almost 22 years. He says he was only a few years shy of his full pension when things went downhill. Now he'll have to make some changes, like cutting out unnecessary expenses like recreation. Managers at the Flint Hills Lane say the plant closing will definitely affect their business. Several Dolly Madison workers were a part of their bowling leagues and spent their money at the business. Mostly bowling money, and uh, of course they'll, they'll frequent the snack bar. Um, they bring their kids. It's a family oriented situation. Now as Dolly Madison workers prepare to curb their spending, businesses surrounding the plant say they'll cut back too. Well, I hope we continue to thrive. Uh, I, I don't think that this would put us out of business by any means, but uh, it will definitely put a dent in the business. This industrial town has seen heartbreak before when Tyson downsized and let 1,500 employees go. That layoff happened in 2008. In Emporia, Sia New Yorker, KWCH 12 Eyewitness News.